Well, hello there guys, and today I'm... Well, at least for now, I'm not gonna go into a PvP live commentary for you guys. But today I'm gonna fulfill one of you guys' uh, request. Something that a lot of people have been asking about. What is the add-on that I'm using to show my debuffs and uh, buffs and etc. Uh, while uh, PvPing, well, it's an add-on called Deeper Filter, and uh, yeah, some and now some of you guys have been asking, how do I set up Deeper Filter like the way I have it? Well, anyways, uh, let's show it. Here's my warrior. Let's uh, type slash Deep Filter. Th then uh, this one pops up. What I usually do here is, uh, you, you can click on here, show backdrop, and that pretty much shows every, uh, <coughs> yeah, everything available to you, and you can drag around it uh, like you want. Just keep uh, shift uh, plus left, and you can uh, move it around. Of course, you can scale it up and down here as you want to. Okay, for the cooldowns, well, I have made a uh, list of cooldowns frames. Well, I have two lists, obviously. One of them is for uh, Deadly Calm and Recklessness. I've moved that one down here. And the other one is Colossal Smash, Overpower and Victory Rush. I've put so it uh, show frame and show available. So, uh, and the other one I've uh, put show frame and show all, and uh, I have not selected as show available. That way, uh, whenever cooldown two, uh, deadly calm and recklessness will be showed at all times, while the, the other cooldowns uh, such as such as colossal smash, overpower, and victory rush will only be showed when available, when they are procked or not or not on cooldown. But how do you make a new list, you may ask. Well, it's very easy actually. You can make a uh, new list of cooldown stuff list here and you press OK. And you see that it uh, comes up right here. And in that new list you can uh, make any sort of. You can make a uh, airy man for himself, for example. Which is my uh, human ability. Add that to list. And uh, let's see how available. You can see now it's available. But now we're using it and now it's no longer there. And then of course you can always go in and you can uh, scale it up and down. You can uh, Go in here to frame layout, find the uh, new list of cooldown and stuff. You can scale it up individually if you don't want to overall scale it, which is right here, but you can scale it individually right here. Pretty nice. You, you've got all sorts of settings here. You can uh, choose how many buffs in a row, and uh, if uh, the amount of buff, buffs is gonna go right or down or whatever. And then there's another thing. Well, I got. Uh, if we go to the uh, target, you go to free buffs, you go to up here and select target. Then uh, you click debuffs. And uh, then you click a show frame, and that's all. And then you have nothing else selected. And then down here, you, you can see, uh, first of all, you can see that box here called target target debuffs. Well, that's where all the stuff is gonna be available to. Well, you can have all sorts of uh, debuffs, uh, you, all the kind of debuffs you want to show there. But uh, in my case, I've only wanted to show the the ones I want to show. The ones I want to show is the ones I've added to this list. 
So you can see, I've uh, added charge, stun, cheap shot, colossal smash, crippling poison, disarm, dismantle, hamstring, improved hamstring, intimidating shout, piercing howl, rent, throw down, and uh, that is uh, show frame on target, and uh, only show frame. So it's only gonna show if the actual target I am currently having as target. Look at that uh, shaman here. And now you can see he has throw down. Now he's gonna have a uh, rent. And intimidating shout. And well, now he obviously doesn't have any other debuffs on him. But anyways, that's how it works. You, you can see only the ones I sh want to show put up there. So, for example, if I were to, you know, this, if I was to, uh, let's go in, and I put Sonder Armor up, that's not gonna show on uh, the target debuffs right here, no, because I haven't chosen it, oh, oh, I thought that uh, Paladin wanted to PP, anyways. So I hope you guys get what I mean. Uh, that oh, now you want to PP or what? Oh, you don't want to PP? You apologize? Well, good for you. Yeah, this was just a quick guide on uh, how it looks for me, how the uh, add-ons is set up. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead here and delete that. And then go back here and show backdrop. I'm gonna turn that off. And I hope you guys uh, got a better idea of how I have my uh, de debuff filter set up. So that's probably many many ways and better ways to set up pr uh, uh, debuff filter than I have. And uh, I'm sure you can find some better ways and I'm sure there is better ways just about configuration and your personal style and what you want to be shown out of your own interest. I mean, some he healers would like one thing to be shown, DPS would like another thing. I mean, if you're a re arena team and you, you only want to get shown what your partner is uh, doing, what kind of debuffs he is doing, like, so you don't disarm when he is doing dismantle, for example. Things like that, it's just nice to know. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and uh, thought it was, if you, it was helpful, then uh, please hit the thumbs up button. That would be very much appreciated. Till next time, bye.